Everyone, welcome to Scorps TV. First episode tonight, lads. I'm Jimmy Munro. I'm with today's special guest, Ed Morris. Jimmy, nice to have you on going? board, mate. Thanks for having me. And tonight, for our first episode, we thought it'd be fitting to go in and meet a few of the boys. Here we go. So, G'day here. I'm here with uh, Mitch Jen. How you going, mate? Good, mate. How are you? Good to see you. Now, um, Mitch, I heard that you're quite a sportsman and you enjoy playing other sports outside of footy. Um, what can you tell me about it? Um, indoor soccer, mate. And um, who do you play for? A uh, little Terro football club. Okay, and um, I heard you played well the other week, And um, but I heard you got uh, might have got an injury. Is this true? Uh, yes, that's what you want to call it. Okay, um, so are you in doubt to play Williamstown this week? It's a big game. Nah. I'll be there. So we're, we'll, we'll, be, uh, we'll be ready, you're ready and uh, rearing to go to play on Saturday, hey? Yeah, I'm rearing to go. <laughs> so here with you yet another star recruit, Jake Gaines. So it's fitting that Jake's actually in the gym at the moment. So tell us, Gainesy, is that why you have your nickname? Because you're an animal in the gym. No, no, just nickname, that's all it is. That's all it is. Now Gainesy, tell us a little bit of an interesting fact about you. Now I've heard a few, but give us a fact that Gainsey! our viewers... <laughs> That our viewers actually don't know about you just yet. Uh, can't think of one off the top of my head, but I don't know. <laughs> Thanks for that, Gaines. So we'll just come over here and talk to the one and only Will Petropolis. Wilbur, good to have you, mate. Welcome to Scorp TV. Yeah, thank yeah, mate, you um, you've, it's been up and down pre-season for you, but you're looking in pretty good shape. Um, you excited about the season? Yeah, definitely. Definitely. We've got a lot of uh, good, young, good young blokes who've come to the club and um, definitely eager to learn and hungry to perform. So definitely plenty of things to look forward to this year again. That's good. And uh, mate, I heard um, the boys are saying the missus was wanting a bit of growth on the face. Is that the uh, the reason for the beard at the moment? Oh no, I thought I was just, just thought I, yeah, I can grow a beard. So I thought, why not? Just see how long I can get it. And that's about it really. No other that, motivation. That's definitely a yes. <laughs> that's, that's it from us. <laughs> so <laughs> we're going to the ice bar, <laughs> the recovery session for the boys. So we're with Jack Hutchins. A massive recruit for the Casey Scorpions, former Gold Coast son. So, mate, what's it like to actually be at a good club? <laughs> <laughs> so, again, Jack Hutchins, you've signed with the Casey Scorpions for the 2015 season. What's it like to be at a good club? Boys played really well. Um, stick to the structures and, um, you know, we'll just put in a four-quarter effort. Now, there's rumours flying around, mate, that you and Michael Ford, the coach, are actually quite close. Um, you know, a few suspicions are flying around. What's your views on all that? I think there's your answer, boys. Fish. G'day, Fish. G'day here. So we've got big Joe Fisher here, and as you can see, he's a big fella. He's been working out of gym. What are you most excited about this year? Um, hopefully having a good back end of the year, playing some good footy and yeah, getting a run to the fellas and uh, getting some wins, finally. Okay, is, it, is this your first year at Casey Scorpion? No, my second year. Okay. And where did you come from uh, before that? Old Haley Roof, amateur football. Uh, so, uh, okay, so he's come from a very, very good footy league and we're expecting big things out of the fish this year. Thanks, Thank you, mate. Good day, guys. <laughs> I'm here with Pooch. I'm here with Pooch now, you know, it's the heart and soul of this football club. Being new to the club, Pooch, uh, I've been told a rumour that you got given your nickname Pooch because you actually barked at an opponent. Is that true? Nah, it's false. So, false. so where, why do you have the nickname Pooch? No, I don't, I don't know. It's honest to God, don't know. Now, I've heard another rumour that Pooch generally, you know, likes to finish his uh, weight session with about 10, 15 minutes of uh, curls. Is that true? Yeah, that's true. Thanks for joining us, Pooch. So we're joined here with Big Keegan Mason. Now, Keys, give us a bit of background about yourself, mate. Oh, just a country bike trying to have a go, mate. From, from up Horsham way, so. Yeah, so, mate, Horsham, for those, none of us know where that is. So uh, what do you do out there for a bit of fun? Oh, uh, look, there's, there's the Royal, yeah. and then after the Royal closes, you go to, the real keen ones go to Willows, but steer clear of Willows if you go to Horsham, Jimmy. <laughs> and now, I've heard a bit of a rumor as well, uh, and I found out by searching your Facebook, you're a bit of a ladies' man. So, do you have a current girlfriend at the moment? No, I don't, no, I don't. Came down to uni with a clean slate, so playing the field at the moment, just <laughs> having a look around. So. Uh, we've all been there, my friend, so uh, good luck for the year, mate. Thanks for you know coming Thanks on board, Squawks TV. 
G'day here, I've got uh, Evan, Evan Panozza, the captain of the footy club. Ev, I was just wondering if I have a word with you, mate. Yeah, so uh, up, this buddy? is your fourth year as captain of the footy club. What does it mean to you? Oh, it's huge, mate. Uh, such a great club and for me to be uh, representing the boys here, uh, it's a real honour and privilege and I'm proud of my achievement. Okay, and you're looking forward to the footy season and the boys are training well and up and about and we're looking forward to a good season. It is, mate. Yeah, the whole club's improved um, over the past six months and we've done power of work, so time to get some results and no doubt we'll um, succeed in what we set out to do. No worries, mate. Thanks for your time. All good, Eddie. You get... Yep. How are you, buddy? Yeah, good. Feeling all right? Yeah, not too bad. Yeah. And what's the go for a little bit of upper lip action right here? Um, I've actually been cast in a uh, porno, so I uh, yeah, thought, thought, thought I'd grow it for a bit and yeah, yeah hopefully play the role well. Yeah. Don't have to grow anything else for the porno? Um, <laughs> no, nothing else. Got plenty of size in that department. <laughs> Woo, you little beauty! He's got a little bit of action! <laughs> Tommy Muir here, sharpest looking bloke. Word around the club rooms is you have the most uh, hair products and good looking stuff in your locker. Is that true or not? Can you confirm true or false that you have the most products to look good after you've trained? Uh, unfortunately, yeah, it is true. It is true, it's all in my locker there, so... What kind of stuff? Oh, a bit of, bit of uh, shampoo, conditioner, uh, some hair wax. Hair gel, just all the essentials, mate. It's all over it. Just look at that. That's yeah. it. It's word on the street, Scorpsville. Yeah.